So, what's the secret sauce? What is that magic elixir? Seriously, what exactly does one of the world's leading longevity researchers take for himself to ward off aging? Want to know what Dr. David Sinclair's supplement regimen really is? What does he know and do that is helping him stay younger longer? Or even help reverse his own aging? Here is David's complete stack of 12 supplements for 2024. Not only will we delve into David's set of revolutionary supplements and their roles in enhancing longevity, but we'll later uncover a resource that has been pivotal in shaping our current understanding of aging, bringing you more invaluable knowledge for those eager to delve deeper into this most fascinating and important topic. And we'll also include a summary in the description of the video for your future reference. In a world where aging seems inevitable, Harvard Medical School's David Sinclair's journey defies the norms. Meet David, who at 53 years old, is redefining what it means to age gracefully. Unlike many of his peers, Dr. Sinclair shows little or no typical signs of aging. No gray hair, no back pain, no health disorders. So how does he do it? Well, it's definitely a carefully crafted combination of lifestyle, exercise, nutrition and supplementation. Dr. Sinclair's regimen is a meticulously designed stack of supplements and drugs, so let's break the 12 down one by one. These supplements, each with its unique properties, work synergistically to combat the effects of aging and promote health and wellness. Here they are. Number one, nicotinamide mononucleotide, NMN. Dr. Sinclair's own daily intake is that of one gram of NMN every morning. NMN plays a pivotal role in enhancing the production of NAD+, a vital molecule that powers numerous metabolic reactions essential for survival. As we age, NAD plus levels decline, potentially leading to aging-related dysfunctions and diseases. By supplementing with NMN, it's possible to not only delay but potentially reverse certain aging aspects. Considering that NMN can be degraded by stomach acid, High-dose supplementation, like Dr. Sinclair's 1,000 mg, is considered effective. This need has also spurred the development of specialized liposomal NMN formulations to maximize absorption. And here's a clarification for you. Many seem to wonder if David takes NMN in powder or pill form. Although he hasn't specified, he does incorporate it into his breakfast. Number two, resveratrol, another cornerstone of David's regimen. He takes one gram each morning. Found naturally in grapes, blueberries and plums, resveratrol activates sirtuins, genes instrumental in protecting and maintaining our DNA. These genes are NAD plus dependent, reinforcing the symbiotic relationship between NMN and resveratrol. The benefits of resveratrol include promoting anti-aging gene expression, enhancing mitochondrial function and supporting healthy glucose levels and inflammation responses. Number three, metformin. For David, it's an 800 milligrams evening dose. Metformin, typically used for type 2 diabetes, has been linked to increased lifespan in various animal models. Dr. Sinclair notes metformin's role in improving insulin sensitivity and regulating blood glucose levels. However, it's important to consult a doctor before using metformin due to its prescription status and potential side effects like gastrointestinal discomfort. Interestingly, Dr. Sinclair avoids metformin on workout days as it may reduce the benefits of exercise. Number four, vitamin D3. David takes a daily dosage of 4,000 to 5,000 IU of vitamin D as is suggested to enhance longevity and reduce the risk of aging-related diseases. Vitamin D is crucial for activating genes vital to health and while the recommended intake for most adults is lower, higher long-term supplementation is considered safe. Number five, vitamin K2 for older individuals, especially those with low vitamin K status. A daily intake of 180 to 360 micrograms of vitamin K2 is recommended. Vitamin K2 offers several benefits, including improved skin quality, bone strength, mitochondrial function, and vascular health. Number six, statin. The usage of statins, particularly simvastatin, has been associated with longevity due to its LDL cholesterol lowering effects. However, not all statins exhibit anti-aging properties and some can cause adverse effects like myopathy. It is not clear how much David Sinclair takes here. Number seven, low dose aspirin. David believes a daily dose of 83 milligrams of aspirin can reduce the risk of heart attacks, inflammation, and certain cancers. 
However, it's crucial to consult a doctor before starting aspirin due to risks like stomach damage and significant bleeding. Number 8. Alpha-lipoic acid, ALA. Dr. Sinclair notes that ALA activates metabolism and energy production pathways, potentially protecting against aging-related diseases. Found in foods like spinach and potatoes, ALA can reduce cholesterol levels and alleviate nerve discomfort in diabetics. However, its effects on aging and longevity are mixed, according to various studies. Again, it isn't clear exactly how much alpha-lipoic acid David takes. Again, consult your healthcare professional. Number 9. Coenzyme Q10, CoQ10. This antioxidant is known for enhancing mitochondrial performance and may influence genes related to aging and inflammation. While CoQ10 has shown potential as an anti-aging treatment in animal models, too much of it can be detrimental, and its overall effectiveness as an anti-aging supplement remains debated. Here again, there is uncertainty as to David's regimen. Number 10. Spermidine. With David's own dose of 1 mg per day, spermidine, found in foods like blue cheese and soy, promotes autophagy, a cellular repair and rejuvenation process. It has been shown to increase lifespan in various animal models and delay human aging. Number 11. Quercetin and Fisetine. David takes these flavonoids at 500 mg each per day. Note that they act as senolytics, eliminating senescent or zombie cells that accumulate with age. They are particularly effective in reducing inflammation and degeneration associated with aging. And at number 12, TMG, trimethylglycine. David's daily dose is 500 to 1000 mg of TMG, a natural methyl donor, which is recommended to support DNA methylation, a critical process for gene regulation. TMG helps maintain the body's methyl pools, which are crucial for preventing damage associated or cancer associated gene activation. Now that you've got a good grasp of David's supplement stack for 2024, you are probably also keen to deepen your understanding of more from David's important book, Lifespan, Why We Age and Why We Don't Have To. It's an essential read. It not only complements the knowledge we've discussed, but also offers transformative insights into the science behind these supplements. For easy access, we've included a direct link to the book in our video description, right there along the summary of the supplements themselves. While research on all of these is promising, it's absolutely crucial for you to consult healthcare professionals before starting any regimen. Be sure Dr. David Sinclair's journey is not just about longevity, it's about redefining the very quality of life as we age. Our health and vitality. His regimen, his blend of science and dedication, offers a glimpse into a future where aging as we know it could be a thing of the past. And do subscribe to our channel for more videos like this.